Every year, millions of patients worldwide receive coronary artery stents for the treatment of ischemic heart disease. To prevent stent thrombosis after treatment with the drug-eluting stent, dual antiplatelet therapy with a platelet P2Y12 receptor inhibitor plus aspirin is recommended for six months to one year. The risks and benefits of treatment beyond one year have remained uncertain. The recently completed DAPT study randomized 10,000 patients who had received an FDA-approved drug-eluting stent had already completed one year of treatment with dual antiplatelet therapy without having ischemic events, repeat revascularizations, or major bleeding, and had shown a high degree of compliance with that year of therapy. The patients were randomized to receive an additional 18 months of either continued dual antiplatelet therapy with aspirin plus a thionopyridine, either clopidogrel or prazogrel, or with aspirin alone. The co-primary endpoints were the incidence of stent thrombosis and a composite of death, MI, or stroke. As compared with aspirin alone, dual antiplatelet therapy resulted in a 1% absolute risk reduction, a 71% relative risk reduction, in instant thrombosis, and a 1.6% absolute risk reduction, a 29% relative risk reduction, in major adverse cardiac and cerebrovascular events. The rate of moderate or severe bleeding was higher in the dual antiplatelet group. At the 33-month follow-up, all-cause mortality was 2.3% in the thionopyridine arm, as compared with 1.8% in the placebo arm. This appeared to be driven by a higher rate of non-cardiovascular death that was accounted for by differences in major trauma associated with bleeding and in cancer-related death. The central conclusions of the DAPT study were that dual antiplatelet therapy continued for an additional 18 months, reduced the risk of instant thrombosis and major adverse cardiac and cerebrovascular events, increased the risk of moderate or severe bleeding, and increased non-cardiovascular mortality. While it doesn't offer an easy answer, this much-awaited trial adds important data to inform individualized decisions about the optimal duration of dual antiplatelet therapy for patients with drug-eluting coronary stents.